Hi guys, for today's video, I will be doing this DIY coffee station. So if you want to know how I did this, just keep on watching. So here's the before guys. So I just decorate this as in plain lang siya na counter. So yung pinaka aming coffee station is yung taas lang talaga ng oven. And I find it really hard dahil walang space na mapagpatungan since super crowded siya. So first, i-clear up natin yung area na i-work out natin. So I decided na palitan ng color yung counter namin from yellow to white. Since every time na nagpo-post ako ng pictures, lagi na lang siyang may yellowish tone. Nagba-bounce back yung color ng counter dun sa mga pinipicturean ko. And it's super time-consuming kasi kailangan ko pa siyang i-edit before posting. Just a simple tips guys, especially kapag ang gamit nyo is vinyl sticker, i-fill up nyo lang yung taas and slowly, gradually, i-work nyo yung way nyo pababa dun sa area. Kasi sobrang hirap niya since manipis yung vinyl na nabili ko. And para ma mawala yung mga bubbles, you need needle para tusok-tusukin siya and i-ano nyo lang siya, i-squeeze-squeeze nyo para mawala yung air. So, after covering the counter entirely, ito yung mga gagamitin ko for this DIY coffee station. So, kung gusto nyo malaman kung saan ko sila mga nabili, comment down below na lang. Since, ang tagal ko na ito nabili, January pa ata. So, first, kailangan yung tanggalin yung mga tags and please, make sure na nalinisan nyo na yung mga jars bago nyo gamitin. So, dyan, dalawang jar lang yung supposed to be gagamitin ko but hindi siya nag-fit. So, I decided na gawing tatlo and then apat. So, lahat ng kasama dun sa collection na ilabas ko na. Kasi, I bought four of these dahil super cute talaga niya. Yung rose gold top niya and super heavy because this is made out of glass. You can tell na yung theme ng aking coffee station is rose gold copper and wood na may hint of black. Ito na yung mga coffee ni Owe guys. So I decided na ilabas ko rin yung aking tea since hindi nga ako marunong magkape. Hindi pa sa ngayon but I am trying talaga. So plano ko rin na palitan yung placemat dun sa taas ng oven but I decided not to kasi nga medyo hindi siya bagay dun sa theme na gusto kong masunod. And again, I decided not to put this PG decaf tea dahil hindi siya bagay dun sa theme. Instead, I put this mint black tea. Anything for the aesthetic, guys. As all you know, may pagka talaga ako and I can help it. So, I got this from Shopee. Copper cup ata yung tawag sa kanya. And I also got this ano, glass straw. Gusto ko siya kasi mabilis makita kapag may nakabara or may dumi or may amag yung loob. And this chopping board is so cute. I end up not using this dahil mas bet ko nga siya dito sa coffee station na gagawin ko. Just a short story guys about this cup. So ginamit to ni Owe, nagtimpla siya ng kape na mainit guys. And pagkagising ko sabi niya sa akin, di daw pwedeng pagtimpla ng kape to kasi pati yung hawakan na init. Diyos ko. This is the placemat that I supposed to use but I end up using this rugged and super abused na placemat since hindi nga ko nga siya bet dun sa theme. So, almost four, five years na ata sa amin tong placemat na to but I super love this still. Now it's time for us to put some decoration since medyo empty yung space sa taas. So, I got this sign, coffee sign. Three, four years ago, sobrang tagal na and super perfect siya dito. So, ibinalik ko na lang siya ulit. And I bought this last year ata. Oo, nasira ko na nga siya eh, kasi nakapatong siya before dyan sa taas ng oven. And nagamit ko yung oven without removing this. Ayun, nagbend yung ilalim and I tried to straighten up. Ayun, mas lalong nasira. Here's the outcome guys, we're super happy dun sa kinalabasan ng DIY coffee station na to since marami ng space na mapagpapatungan ng mga cups, mugs, and kapag nagtitimpla ng kape, 
hindi na ganun ka crowded. Ayun naman yung pinaka-importante when you're doing or recreating a space. It should be more useful than before. for watching guys don't forget to hit the thumbs up if you like this video subscribe for more videos and hope to see you soon bye